Hey buddy, what's up? Shoe Funk here, and we are here with another expansion for um, Hearthstone. It is the um, man. What is this called again? It's something Dark Moon. Uh, Madness of the Dark Moon Fair, which is uh, I think it's like the Dark Moon Fair is like. A special event that happens in WoW every year and the Dark Moon Fair is happening and something happens where like the old gods come back and I think that's what this is about based on what I um, learned on my own at least without going deep into it but anyway uh, the expansions out um, I sadly wasn't able to show y'all the pop-ups that usually does when you first launch but I launched the game uh, prematurely just to make sure uh, the download was triggered and I didn't realize it automatically downloaded for me as I was sleeping earlier. So anyway, this is the actual expansion. I did get a, um, a, uh, a card unlock uh, as you usually do. Uh, when you pre-purchase and it, this is a legendary that I got it's, it was a warlock card uh, what was it again it was a um, level six it was that one right no that one right there the deck of chaos and it says swap the cost and attack of all minions in your deck. That is an interesting card. Now I don't play Warlock a lot, um, so I might have to tinker with a Warlock to to make use of that card, that free legendary. But who who knows? I might get some more legendaries tonight. As per usual, I always buy the. Um, the pre-pack and prior to the pre-pack um, this new journal system allowed me to get a few extra decks which I've already redeemed so um, I'm seeing if I'm caught up on my levels oh, I'm level 19 and my next one will be this one. Anyway, I got... I opened that deck pack already. That was just a regular pack. I think that's a regular pack. Too. Yeah, that was a regular pack. A uh, regular pack. I think these are Dark Moon Fair ones. Yeah, so I got three extra Dark Moon Fair cards. Uh, plus the ones I got for my pre-purchase. So that's a total of 48 right now. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and open these up and see what the hell we have here, and then we'll get to learning of the, um, expansion. So here we go. Man! Free admission is a warlock card. Draw two minions. If they are both demons, reduce their card. But okay, that's not bad. The druid card, your next spell this turn. So just one spell? Well, obviously the next spell, the one spell. Okay. Hmm. Shaman, revolve. Transform all minions into random ones with the same cost. Oh, that's pretty cool. So Shaman has that ability to do that now. Uh, there's a generic card. Your other minions have plus. Okay, so that's the thing. <clears throat> I heard the new sub power, or at least whatever, you know, you have um, outcast and, um, you know, overload and stuff like that. The new deal is called corrupt. I don't know what that is yet, but this one says your other minions have one plus attack. Corrupt this gains four attacks. So, does that mean all minions get one plus four? 
or that one changes from zero to four if you're corrupt. See, I don't know how that works or anything like that. But anyway, that's press. That's the first one. It's pretty cool to know what that is. Oh, here we go. It's corrupt. Upgrade in hand after you put. Well, duh. Okay, Ooh, that's nice. So check this out. This one's called Circus Armagolem, or Ammo Amalgam. It's one of them multi minion deals. And this one's a class four. Has four attack and five health. That's actually pretty cool. So it gives you the ability to um have like a super minion again. Because there hasn't been really any minions, or at least up, special upgrades you can do uh, for that. So that's pretty cool. Alright, a lot of talking about the pack. We've got 47 to go. Bam! Ooh. <laughs> that one's good. Look at this one. Summon an eight eight elemental. Repeat for each elemental you played this. You played last turn. So if I play some elementals last turn and I knew they were going to die, I can add nothing but eight eights in there. Oh, that's pretty cool. Ah, oh, new mech. Fresh death rattle. Draw a minion and give it three three. That's pretty cool. Demon Hunter, your outcast cards cost one less. Eh, okay. New mage card. Um, add two, one, two sugar elementals to your hand. Huh. Oh, <laughs> confectionate cyclone. That's, that's, uh, looks like a, uh, cyclone made out of, um, I can't tell if that's cotton candy or ice cream or whatever, but I'd hate to be eaten by that. Bam! Pitmaster, summon a 3-2 duelist, corrupt, summon 2. Okay, again, I don't know what corrupt is, but that is good to know that you naturally get 1, and you can end up getting 2 if you're corrupt. Okay, and that's a shaman. It's up, it still says corrupt, upgrades in hand after you play a card that costs more. See, I don't know what that means. Let's see, when you, wait, when your turn starts, if you control two minions, summon an animal, oh, that's a good one, because, um, if I have that, let's see here, what's that, it's that, it's that, ha that AM hair or something like that, it's like a, it's, it's that rabbit one, that, that summons two rabbits, say you summon those two rabbits, and you know that you know your opponent can't really um, do anything, so you you do that your second turn because the rabbits are only one cost. You run out in your second turn, and then on your third turn, you have three minions. That's pretty cool. I think I already have that one. Wait, draw two cards. If you if you play both this turn, draw two more. What the fuck does that mean? Bam! Death rattle. Shuffle three tickets into your deck when drawn. Summon a. Ooh, that's pretty cool. That's a rogue though. That should be a neutral card. Why is that a neutral card? Like that should be an epic neutral card. Whatever. Oh, that's pretty cool. Another one of those. Yep. Oh, achievements. Restore. Oh, that's pretty cool. Again, I don't know what corrupt means. Does that mean it's gonna deal damage to me? Or 
the thing that you do it to. Oh, I have to figure that out. Anyway, what's this one? Brush to. Oh, that's pretty cool. Bam! If you played the elemental last turn, deal three. Oh, okay, so. First epic, Stilt Stepper, Battle Cry, uh, draw a card. If you play it this turn, give your hero for attack this turn. <sighs> I don't like that. Especially for a Demon Hunter. Demon Hunters are too fucking OP when it comes to their fucking attacks. I swear to God. I'm playing against a demon hunter earlier, I think last night or the night before, and the guy kept on buffing and buffing and buffing, and I was like, what the fuck, and he ended up doing like 14 hit points on me. I was like, what the fuck? Anyway. Wait, what? Oh, it's a neutral card. Uh, Battle Cry, cast a ca Okay, that's pretty cool. I like that being a neutral card because there's another similar neutral card. I'm mean, not uh, like a similar card, but I think it's for just a hunter. Ooh, that one's a good card. <laughs> That's a good one. You either summon three or five of your corrupt. Epic! Oh wow, I got a legendary and an epic. Oh, no, I got two epics, I mean. <laughs> no mixed cards yet. I'm not sure they have any mixed cards in this version. Whoa, what? Wow. I really need to figure out what corrupt is. Bam. There's my legendary. Ooh, it's a mage card too. All right, so this one's called Seiji Seer of Dark Moon. Battle cry: Draw one card. Upgrade for each friendly secret that has triggered this game. So why is that a legendary? Drawing cards is not a legendary status to me. That's just annoying. Oh wow, that could be an 8-8 one too. That's pretty cool. Man. Wait, is that an all clap? Nice. See, that's the thing. <clears throat> I'm, as usual, and I haven't played my uh, Ranger in a while, I've been thinking about going back to Ranger, and I'm really hoping there's some decent Ranger cards, or at least some Beast. And so far, that's a good Beast card. Got that one again. Wait, what's this one? Oh, that's actually nice. Too bad it's Demon Hunter only. That should be... That should be like... A Demon Hunter, maybe a Thief card. And like maybe a Mage card. That's what It should be like three different... Um, because I can see a mage having a uh... Man. Wait, 
Wait, what? After a minion attacks your hero, summon a copy of it with stuff. Oh, that's pretty cool. Random taunt man in your hand. Fi oh, in your hand. That's still just not bad. Man, so many road cards today. spell and just cast twice. Wait, what? I've seen that card before. Huh. Man. Here's grand finale. Pretty cool. Golden Common! Wait, what? Battle Cry, give adjacent minions. Oh, it's a common too. <gasps> nice. <laughs> that one plus the one that allows you to do one plus one plus taunt is a great combo. So that way you can get at least two plus two in combo and you have two different minions. Um. Oh, you know what? I'm thinking of the way of battleground mode. You can't just swap them around. Oh well. Another one that gives you a sword after you battle cry. a good powerful one but uh it's no one than 50 percent chance to miss kind of deals Ooh, a priest let's see summon a random Ooh. that's actually a good one so a lot of good neutral cards i need to start looking at neutral cards again and add them to my deck because Lately, I've been trying to, I'm not saying copy somebody's decks, but I, I do remember seeing certain cards a lot when I play against certain people, so I get an idea of what cards to use. But certain decks that I have, it's like, okay, I'm getting the right stuff, but I need extra cards. I don't want to do like, you know, not saying mage only or, you know, warlock only, but like I need to know which good neutral cards are good with certain decks that will go with those OP decks. Man. Wait, what? Well, that's weird. The only one to have six or more attack if you had a weapon on you that was upgraded. Ooh, cool, another one of those. Oh, this one already has divine shield, and if you corrupt it, it gains three three and taunt, making an eight eight. Oh, that's. Cool. Oh, it's a paladin card, though. God damn it. I thought that was a neutral. Can you imagine a neutral card being out of power, though? Man. Whenever you summon a one health minion, give it one, two. Oh, so that's good for uh, when you summon um, the uh, silver wards, or whatever they're called. Epic! Jewel of Nazar.
off. Summon three friendly death rattle minions that die this game. Wait, would I? Ooh. Ooh. I already know a good a good set amount of cards that will work with that. It would be a great way to kind of come back last second. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Wait, discover a secret? Oh, wow, that's cheap. That's for a hunter. Strider, repeat for each secret you control. Ooh. That's a good one. Because sometimes I usually have like two or three secrets. They're not triggered right away. That's a nice cheap card. Yeah, see, I'm going to be able to make a good, decent... I mean, I hate that it hurts me, but it hurts both of us. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's pretty cool. Ooh. Summon a 3-2 duelist. If your hero attack this turn, summon another. Oh, it's for a shaman? So I think I have to have a weapon for that one, I think. Hmm. Yeah, it's like the third petting zoo. I'm starting to see doubles and triples now. Ooh, that's a good one for that one combo because what it was it it was a cost three that has up to five if you were to be corrupt so for seven gems and i was corrupt i'm not sure how corrupt works i can do that one first and then give all of them plus one attack and divine shield. Oh my god, that would be epic. Man. Man. What's that one? Taunt, battle cry, add a random... Wait, what? Why would you do that? Add a random four cost minion to your opponent's hand. That's weird. Wow, golden legendary! Whoa! A golden legendary! Sea Thunder Shattered! Start of the game, break into pieces, battle cry. Deal. Wow! That is so. I'm taking a screenshot. Holy shit! Why is it not allowing me to take a screenshot? There it goes. Wow! Oh my god! That is so fucking epic! A golden legendary! Golden legendary! Wow! Holy shit, that's fucking sweet! 
<laughs> wow. That is so fucking cool. I knew there was a Seaton card. I didn't realize I was going to get a golden version of it. Oh, I'm curious how it works because it's the start of the game, breaking the pieces. So I wonder if it like, if you have to like draw the cards. Oh my God! Oh, that's so cool. Golden common. Oh my god. Fucking hell. I cannot believe I got that. Nice. I got that in my preview because I've been playing that duelist, but now I actually have it as a card. That is a good card. Because, as you see, it says deal t 10 damage, randomly split among all enemies. So it's kind of like doing the, um, the, the missiles. But instead of three, you're doing ten. But like, as you have better damage, it's going to be eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, etc. So if you're lucky, and there's no minions on the board, you're doing a guaranteed ten damage. The only problem <clears throat> is. There's another arcane missile. It's like advanced arcane missiles or something like that that does three damage per hit. And you only do three, so you'll do up to nine. And you can't do both at the same time. Um, that's the sad thing. second one and that was a three cards cost card that's good so what I said earlier would actually work out Ooh, an elemental as uh that's generic that's pretty cool. Cool, so I got a golden version. Now. Bam. 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 Wait, what? Wow, that's a rush and a taunt. Oh, it's a druid card. Still good God. Gold 
entkommen? Rare. Okay. Oh, that's a good one. Too bad. Oh, actually, shamans have very similar spells. That was just a fun version. So, do it for damage and then two to all. So, it's kind of like that, um, that, uh, lightning one they have. Rare. Golden Common. Eclipse. Wait, do I have solar eclipse and lunar eclipse? I have to look that later on. Give all beasts in your hand 1-1. One, one. Corrupt, give them 2-2 two, two instead. Okay. It's a cost 2, not bad. Yeah, again, I need to figure out what corrupt means. Whack a null hammer. After your hero attacks, give her family. Oh, that was pretty cool. It's a show. Okay, so check this out. That one right there, I actually used in the um, duelist mode. It says transform spells in your deck into ones that cost three or more. 
or it costs three more. They keep the original cost. So, it's great to use when, in a way, you feel you have a bunch of shit cards in your deck late in game where they might be good early game or vice versa. And you just feel like you really need to change it up. That's a good card to have. Now, what it gives you, though, is a bunch of random mage spells that, in a way, are not going to be useful. <laughs> so that's the problem. But it's a pretty decent card. It actually helped me uh, get very far in my mage deck, uh, which I got as high as uh, eight wins. But I didn't use it every single game. I used it maybe twice. Lunar. Yeah. Huh. Summon seven one one with rush. If they die this turn, summon seven more. Wait, what? Oh, if they all die this turn, seven. Oh. <laughs> That's a good card, because if you think about it, sometimes somebody might bring up a very strong card. And this one has 7, right? Well, say it had 14 health. Well, you can kill down that 14 health one real easily by clearing the board. But, yeah. Cards unlocked. I'm kind of curious if I can use these cards now in this mode, but we'll see. Man. Rush after his attack and kills and being excessive damage hits the enemy hero. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I can't wait to make another beast deck. I love playing as a hunter, but I haven't played as a hunter lately. Give me the ability to play as a hunter again. Golden Common. After a friendly Murloc dies, add a random legendary minion to your hand. Oh, really? So that'd be good for my Murloc deck. Well, for Wild at least. Secret, if you didn't take any damage during your opponent's turn, draw all take all. Bam! Got that seat on the car, guys. Let's see how much that was worth. It's, it's probably worth an arm and a leg.
just going through the mall just to see what I have out of curiosity to refresh myself. Was an eight? Wow, that one's cheap. Just been ten. There it is, right there. Look at that. Look at that. I cannot believe I got that card. Thirty-two hundred dust just to get the gold version and I got it for free oh my god that is so fucking cool just a chant hell fucking no all right so if all of those cards that I got early wow they're only commons and they're worth up to 270 uh, whatever later and um, see if we can get some decks going on so anyway um, that's it for this video guys thanks for watching and uh, I hope to uh, learn some more about these uh, new cards and get to kick some ass so I um, hope you learned some stuff from me if not it's all good you know we're all learning um, <laughs> things brand new you know every time a new expansion comes out but uh, like I said, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and you have a good day.